Okay, everybody, we are down to our final four players. There's going to be Sparks versus Griffin in 04 versus KM Ray. And my esteemed colleague here, Ice, has actually pulled up some of 04's record uh, to fill some of you guys in. He did get first place at QuakeCon in, two th or in, yeah, in 2000, first place at CPL in 2000, first place at QuakeCon 01, uh, first place yeah. at uh, another CPL event in 02, uh, first place in Duel, and second place in CTF at QuakeCon 03, second in Duel in 03 at ESWC, and second at QuakeCon 04 in Duel, as well as second at 08 in Duel and first in CTF. So yeah, so he's you very don't have to leave. You totally <laughs> don't have to. I mean, you know this is going to be epic. You're going to regret things. I mean, what what what's more important, this or like you know, getting StarCraft 2 like 20 minutes early. I'm waiting for tomorrow for StarCraft 2 because, you know, Quake is where it's at. You have a point. See, man's I, got his priorities I, I straight. I think my love for Quake Live is probably going to rule here because this is pretty damn epic and I don't want to miss it. Uh, it's Thanksgiving all over again. <laughs> You'll live. Isn't it? You will live. All right, I guys. Really, you're going to play StarCraft 2 all day tomorrow anyway. I, I really am, yeah. I really am. Okay. Trying to get the so servers have work in the morning. Away. Jeez. Looks like they're still trying to pick uh, where, th where they ping best. So yeah, guys, we're, we're not going to stop. Um, I was going to have Jahar take over streaming, but I don't want to miss these games, so fuck it. <laughs> exactly. Fuck it. I'm, I'm glad to see you come around, man. I knew you could do it. Almost had to have a little intervention for you. We're all here because we love the heck out of you. Just for the record, apparently Polcat is wearing a strapless b bra and Oshkosh shorts. <laughs> nice. Oh baby. I'm wearing I'm wearing boxers and the last remaining orange logo Quake Live shirt from QuakeCon 2009. It was like the last available one, and I wanted it so bad, and I got it. I'm so happy. Zero four versus Ray coming up, and then we're gonna follow that with Sparks versus Griffin. My hope is that they will wait. Can I have the admins please coordinate that, please? You know what though? You know what I noticed? Sync error showed up, and uh, we don't have spam anymore. Did you, did you guys notice that? Out of the Damn tournament. straight! Uh, I could so see him showing up Chuck Norris style. Bust through the Sink wall. Is Chuck Norris? Okay, I'm Seriously. Chuck Norris with awesome kids. That's one thing Chuck Norris doesn't have. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> I love Ninja K and Starbuck. They are so awesome. Just saying. I mean, it's gotta suck when your sperm are so competitive that they kill each other. Kinda makes you infertile in like the most awesome way. Yeah, it's like a DM pre-coitus. Or not pre-coitus, post-coitus. All right. So what happens? And who really Z4 wants to here? stick around with him after you know he leaves a bunch of dead sperm? Anyway, it's just, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's not a charmer right there. All right. <laughs> G12 is saying, "What the fuck is wrong with you guys?" Oh, it's funny. I don't think that uh, the ESL staff is necessarily um, acclimated to all the crazy shit we talk about on stream. That's all right. No, I forgot. And uh, what was that about you wanting to be in the same place as a bunch of nerds screaming in ecstasy? <laughs> it's like that really awkward part in Smooth Criminal. I don't re more really want to be part of that. I mean, sure, they were all wearing cool suits, but what the hell were they doing? Okay, holy crap, we got maps chosen. Let's go. And Ray picking T7. So yeah, no rail for at least the first map. Hey, and we are going to see Ray facing off against 0-4. This is the first semifinals Ray of the night. Ray is ready. Ray was unready. Hope he knows that. Oh. oh, he's up. Here we go. Great, oh, we're Steve relegated on to the task day. of uh, broadcasting whether or not somebody is ready. <laughs> <laughs> he pulls out his F3 at the last second! I got yelled yeah. at for not repping the most powerful clan in Quake Live. <laughs> in Quake Live, really? Really? <laughs> hmm. 
I know ESL is hoping to get to that point because there's going to be a main lot beef of people playing that game. My major concern is the fact that Blizzard wants to at least have some control and a decent cut of the money for any paid StarCraft 2 tournaments in the future. But look at how they're supporting the community, though. I mean, like, that that's what I enjoy. With no like, plan? Well, yeah, but oh. put it this way, though. Yeah, but no one's uh -huh. doing land clients anymore. Quake Live land client? What? Hey, beta, dude, beta. We're talking about a product being released. Quake tonight Live land on client? What? I'm just saying. You know. Alpha, dude. We're beta. I mean, we're talking about a box on the shelf of released products. All right. And it's not just the lack you, of you land really, clients. You really think the there's going to be a land client for Quake Live? You really think there is? No, but no. That, that's okay. A completely different so subject. stop talking. I'm just saying. Speculation. At least, at least be fair. At least be fair. See, in, Steve in knows where I'm coming from. <laughs> that's, that's we right. could get a land client. I, I, I hope we get a yeah, land client. I'm going to warn you now, this will probably be a good time to stop talking. Well, I don't even I gotta know. Be, I gotta like... be the little angel on your shoulder right now. It's a little geeky white angel. All I'm saying is, uh, it's doubtful. Given you know, all that we've ever heard about Quake Live. I mean, yeah, if they but do one, speculation. I'll, be, I'll be more than happy. This is a known fact. I mean, it's in stone. It's on the box. Okay. But why... Okay. As of right now, you can't play on land for either one unless you have support from the company. So, just taking uh -huh. things as they are. At least you don't have to pay in software. Uh, what? You don't have to give them a cut of the money for a paid tournament. As far as I know, unless there's some shady shit going on. Anywho, Quake Live right now. All right. I'm just saying it, it ain't free, I'm guessing. So we have Mega starting 0-4, and he heads for a shotgun out to a rocket launcher. He sees that it's already gone, so he ducks for the yellow armor that's not there, and he decides to go for an LG. Now, this is kind of the critical thing. 0-4's going to have a hard time getting out of this room if Ray plays it right, and he's late. So... I think you yeah, have a bit of a mistake there by Ray to not lock Zero Four out of center since he got the first uh, rocket launcher. Basically means free red armor. Mm. I like this play by Zero Four, except he apparently didn't hear Ray going out that direction the first time. He could have been a little bit snappier on the play for Red, but snappy or not, he's got it, but that leaves Ray up with mega health and no real attack doable by Zero Four on that item. But he's back up here in mid. He's got control of the rocket launcher, and in fact, rocket launcher LG shotgun for him. Ray also loaded up, so this is going to be mono e mono. Ray, though, I got to say, with yellow armors and that mega, he's got a pretty decent stack going on right now. Zero four is going to be able to pick up red, but he's probably going to get quite a lot of it burned off on his X. Oh my God! Not a single point of splash so far. Biting out the teleporter, and geez, that was absolutely free. But no, not on the mega. Ray's gonna get out of that though, taking just the barest amount of splash. I mean, 290 right now, 0 for 100, 137. Looking very, very good for Ray at the moment. Nice LG. 0 for trying to get Impetus to do damage on the red, and he does not really do so. Instead, he eats a rocket straight to the face. 0 for having to back off into the bowels of the map. Looking for a little bit of yellow to keep him alive. Ray, enjoying Mega in about two seconds. Red's up in three, though. Ray does not have it on lockdown. He does do a little bit of damage before pickup, a little bit of damage after pickup. And without rockets, though, Ray's going to be a little bit slow to get around this corridor. This could uh, work against him. It does not. Wow. Zero four, zero four, zero four. Okay. Hiding out at Mega. You have lost the lead. And Ooh, finally, wow, there's nice. Fresh. 
And Ray is looking to follow it up immediately off of this with the LG and gets the damage done. Barely a little bit of a scratch on him, but Red Armor is going to be up. He's looking for a response with the rocket jump at the yellow armor. Zero four. What was he doing there? Go away, Zero four. Uh, I, well, he wanted to go close range with the buckshot because as you fall, uh, you're basically right. all stationary as you drop. I think he wanted to try to get that buckshot into Ray's dome. Didn't pan out though. Ray was able to defend with the rocket, so 2 0. Ray is uh, running pretty solidly here. Mega is up right now. Drops in on it, eats tons of rockets, doesn't rocket jump out, so he eats even more damage, but he does get positioned for red, eating more damage now, 30 health, and as he gets away. 0 4 with 41 health, taking this fight. This is an insane fight to go for, but 0 4 does it anyway. Mutual frag 3 to 1. Nice, and Zero Four trying to get out, but oh, that bounce is going to be deadly. It's going to be no way through the door with that kind of rocket splash, that kind of rocket bounce. Ray picking up four on one. Red Arms back up. Ray with quite a bit of the mega health left over here after that small fight. Zero Four picking up Red, just wanting to beat Heat right now, just create some distance between himself and Ray, and possibly uh, making that attack. I mean, this is a nice poke out, but he honestly has more to lose than he has to gain right here. Nice, Ray a little bit off with the LG, trying to do a spin move for the red, didn't quite time it right, and 0-4 is going to be coming in strong, one health for Ray, and he backs into a mega, holy shitball. 0-4 getting away with 60 health, immediate rocket jump, going in for the kill, trying to get it, and he's landed it to make it a one frag game, ladies and gentlemen, this is the 0-4 we showed up to see in Stevo. Uh, are, are you are you pitching a tent at this point? Are you enjoying the frags, my friend? You know, I really, really am. I mean, and and it's not just John's frags. I love John just as much as the next, you know, classic Quake fan. But seeing Ray do this well against him, yes. it, fuck yeah, yeah. It's, it's a beautiful sight. And you know, I kind of feel like this is the game where Ray will earn his street cred. Because I think a lot of people, myself included, sort of, you know, think of Ray as, you know, a, a decent player, but um, kind of lacks the the kind of experience and the uh, um, consistency. But we've seen uh, each week, he's done extremely well uh, coming in, I think, probably third place or, or better uh, for most of these cups, including the open cups. And of course, playing a 0 4 is uh, no small feat. And then leading 0 4 by two frags on DM 13, no less. Uh, really impressive. Yeah, and uh, I've actually been watching Ray quite a bit because of. Uh, you know, there, there are tournaments where there's pro and am divisions, and, and I think he's ready for a pro division. You heard it here, folks. I agree <laughs> wholeheartedly. I mean, Nightmare, the way they've been working together, their presence in the tournaments, oh, they've man. just been going on and on. And of course, Ray isn't exactly doing the most professional looking thing as I'm saying that, getting kind of bounced around, but he <laughs> survived that somehow. Apparently, Zero Four didn't want to stick around for the possibility of Ray's last rocket getting the last word in, but Ray now stacking back up 74 65 with one rocket to his name. Bit of LG, but he's got to be careful coming out of here. Going out silently. Spots no zero four. No yellow armor back up on the map yet. Ten seconds left to red armor. I mean, Ray's in a bit of a bind here, but he's still alive. And to be honest, zero four. I mean, it's five on three. That situation right there might have been worth the risk of just sticking around for that last shot. Maybe. Maybe. Yeah. I mean, look at this turnaround here. Zero four. Pretty much maintaining the map. And this is where the frags are going to come. You'll probably see a rocket jump, collect the yellow armor, and now Ray is basically screwed. Uh, he will try to basically delay as long as he can, but here's the issue. Three minutes, less than three minutes left to go. Zero four can basically play this all day long. He'll eventually run out of rockets, but there's still the issue of, you know, when that one frag happens, I mean, you need to basically time when the, you have to make a decision here. If you wait too long, you're eventually, holy crap. Oh. 